Hello everyone, my name is Josh from Drastic and welcome to another Nukes Top 5 video. It's been a while, it's been some time since I've done a Nukes Top 5 video. Uh, is there any reason? No, there is absolutely no reason that I haven't done a Nukes Top 5 video in a while. Other than I just didn't feel like it. <laughs> it's 23 minutes long and it's called Top 5 Scary Ghosts That Make You Cry For Your Mama. I can't believe I haven't seen this one, and there's going to be a lot of Nukes Top 5 videos coming out after this, because I've missed a bunch. Um, so yeah, prepare for that. Also, reason why I haven't been gone, or why I haven't been here for three days, uh, I am saving money to get myself a better mic. You see this mic right here? This mic is a cheap $15 mic that I found on Amazon. I'm going to be getting HyperX mics. I, I like HyperX products. Or, uh, it's HX, but I don't know why I call it HyperX. I don't even think that's the name of it. But it's HX. I'm going to get an HX mic. It's going to be rad. It's going to be all red. Like I like it. Like my seat. I wonder if HX makes seats. I should just get a bunch of HX brand. I don't know. I like HX. They've lasted me. Like these headphones have lasted me so long. Um... The, like this microphone this $15 like actual microphone is literally the same quality as this little thing that plugs into my HX It's the same exact quality. So I'm hoping with uh, when I upgrade it um, It will hopefully sound better, uh, but yeah anyways um, Anything else do I need to say? No, I know I, I, I got a new light this new light right here is gonna be for VR stuff so VR stuff is coming soon. I'm going to be doing VR. I'm still editing that GTA video. I haven't touched it in a while. I need to touch it. I need to get working back on it. Uh, I've been recently learning a lot about cars and stuff. So my priorities have been kind of out of whack. I've been learning a lot about cars and uh, how to fix an old junker. I don't have an old junker, but I would love to have one one day. Um... And yeah, anything else that I need to update to you on? Tay Tay's behind me. Uh, you guys can't see her. Sad face. Um, hopefully, when I make a little bit more money, hopefully if YouTube ever actually like starts paying me, um, I could afford a camera. You know? And you guys wouldn't be seeing me via my uh, iPhone 7. Yeah. Anyways, without further ado... I have nothing else to say. Let's begin. Wrong button. Let's begin. God, I haven't watched one of these in forever. Top five ghosts. Caught on, on camera. camera. Don't wake the baby. Ah, oh, Italian no. YouTubers Paolo, Debbie, and Simona from the YouTube channel PIT Paranormal Investigation Team Ooh, were contacted like this. by one of their viewers about a spooky local legend in a dark forest. Oh yeah. The legend says that there's a certain tree in the woods Let's turn this down and underneath it sits an old abandoned stroller. Then above the stroller, there's a there bell go. attached to one of the tree's branches. Locals believe that in the stroller rests the spirit of a baby who tragically passed away under mysterious circumstances many years ago. Furthermore, Weird. it's believed that if anyone nearby makes too much noise, the spirit of the baby wakes up and the bell in the tree starts to ring. But even Weird. more ominous, it is said that when the bell rings, an evil entity comes to protect the spirit of the infant. And this entity will attack whoever disturbed the child. The PIT Paranormal Investigation Team travel to the mysterious forest and wait until nightfall. They search through the woods and eventually find the tree and the stroller. They put an EMF detector inside and just wait. No, ma neanche a me va a zero. Mamma mia. Raga, brilla. Raga, sta brillando. You're getting one. Sta brillando. It's not going all the red. Sta brillando. Although it is a. Sta brillando. It is supposed to be. A... Oh, you're screwed now. <laughs> You're gonna die. Eh, ma poco. 
Ma rumore che ha fatto? Vento? Ti prego, dimmi che è stato il vento. Dimmi. Non, lo so. non lo so, non lo so, non lo so. Ha suonato, ha suonato, ha suonato. Ha suonato. Ha suonato dopo, dopo che ha brillato il mio uno. Quindi adesso? E quindi che ne so adesso? Weird. Well, you're now you're gonna die. Non mi piace. You have done the bad. Quindi adesso in teoria... And the bad shall return. It's called karma. Sì. Esatto. The bell rings. Oh yeah. Which according to the legend means that the baby has been disturbed and that the evil entity is coming for them. Both Debbie and Simone are more than a little freaked out and already feel surrounded by something that is lurking so this, in the woods. Like the bell only ring Paolo once. Paolo wants to see more. He grabs the stroller and starts to threaten the entity, yelling aloud that he will take the baby away. What happens next is downright chilling. What? Does he get thrown across the room or something? Poi non so se suggestione, raga. Cosa? Io mi sento tirare la carrozzina. Che senso ti senti tirare la carrozzina? Come se dalla parte ci fosse qualcun altro. And you just wouldn't know. Che la sta. Me la, come se me la stesse Unless togliendo dalle mani. Out from his hands, I don't... Me la sta spingendo. Mollala. Io dalla, dalla, dalla termica yeah, there's nothing on the thermals, my guy. non vedo assolutamente niente. So nothing's happening. Per dirtelo. Mollala. Io dalla termica non vedo niente di strano, raga. Oh, 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 si muove, si muove, si muove. Paolo, Paolo, te l'ho detto. Paolo, 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 l'hai provocata. Ha funzionato. Ok, è qua, 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 Raga, no. I see nothing. Raga. Cosa? Vi giuro l'ho vista passare. Ho visto I see passare nothing. qualcosa. Raga, l'ho filmato, sono quasi sicuro. Ok. Ho Then show la me. Torcia. Raga, è passata una persona laggiù. È passato qualcosa laggiù. Non un animale. The creepy figure of what appears to be a woman can be seen quickly running through the dark woods. Could this be the evil entity that is said to come when the bell rings? Is it possible that this female spirit could be protecting the long abandoned spirit of the child in the stroller? I don't know. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. It's pretty funny looking. PIT Paranormal Investigation Team is now releasing their investigations in both English and Italian. Wonderful! I don't know if this is real, but if you're loud, the baby's gonna wake up. So you can watch this full three part series in English or Italian over oh. on their YouTube channel. The whoa, whoa, whoa! Good for them. Good for them. I don't know how they did that. But that is cool. So now they can get their American viewers up in there. Awesome. Visitor. Chris Coltman from the Netherlands. Because you know us Americans don't understand Italian. <laughs> explaining that his family has been experiencing some very strange activity. Wait, did he say they spoke Italian? I can't remember. In their house. Chris says that his five-year-old son has sure been having terrible over trouble video. falling asleep ever since the little boy's grandmother oh, passed away. The <laughs> five-year-old would wake up in the middle of the night, making the typical claim of any frightened child what? that there was, quote, something scary in his room. The boy repeated this multiple nights until finally Chris decided to buy a motion detection camera to prove to the child once and for all that there was simply nothing there. But and instead, the camera captures something downright creepy. Creepy. What it capture? What it do? That is a mouse. That not a. That's a kid moving. Now, obviously, because of that the potato mouse. quality of the camera, it's hard to tell exactly what is going on here. That a mouse. All that we can make out is a strange dark shape that seems to move and disappear along the side of the boy's bed. 
Now, after reviewing the footage and seeing this bizarre incident, Almost. Chris decides to buy a new, higher quality camera. Oh, good for him. And sure enough, the camera captures something. I don't know what. We'll capture now. That mouse got hops. Another unexplained dark shape seems to move right next to the boy as he sleeps. It almost looks like the translucent shape touches the boy's hand, and the child even seems to react to the touch in his sleep. Another night, Weird. and Chris is laying in bed with his son to comfort him, waiting until the boy falls asleep so that he can sneak out of the room. But then, as you do, this happens. Books sitting on top of a shelf suddenly get tipped over and fall hard onto the floor. They could have Chris fell and his son wake really... up and the boy's mother quickly hurries into the room to see if the two are okay. Both Chris and his wife have no idea what just happened. So are Chris and his family haunted by an invisible entity that only his son can see? And if not, then just what is this? Let me know what you think. It's a mouse. If you see a video that you think would be perfect it's a mouse, for the top the five, or if you have a ghost hunting channel and you caught something great, contact me at nukestop5 at gmail.com. Although, those are just see, my explanations for what it was. I have no idea. Could have been. It could have totally been a spirit. I have no idea. I don't know. But like, there wasn't any like hard proof evidence. I mean, like, this guy could have just honestly, honest to God, captured some books falling over one night while he was sleeping with his son and like a mouse another night and then maybe a fly that the son was swatting away like it could have honestly been all that <laughs> i don't know where they live i don't know if their house is even maybe the books fell because the house was uneven i don't know he's something Indian YouTuber Robbie from the YouTube channel Biryani Man and his friends set out to explore an abandoned house in Madras, India. The four friends don't know much about the house other than that the building was abandoned because the property is said to be extremely haunted. Once inside, they find something very Amazing. disturbing. What they find? <laughs> All right, I see wires or a rope. Team member Vicky is a bit upset by an old rope hanging from the ceiling inside one of the rooms. But the other guys don't really seem to think much of it. No. But then, YouTuber Robbie sees something shocking right behind him. Why is it always behind? I like how they're all there with their friends. Nice. Get a light on this man. I can't see him. Someone or something seems to walk from left to right, outside, right behind the unsuspecting group. Pretty quickly. When they check out the area, Very skinny. there's just no one there. The four friends decide to take a quick break outside the house to gather their thoughts, and that's when things quick get lunch break? truly bizarre. <laughs> What's so truly bizarre? <laughs> Weird. 
But you do have a lot of friends there. Could have been one of your friends. You guys are just freaking about, about one of your friends being walked right up there. And a dark figure can be seen, this time from one of the upstairs windows. Why is it the guys always go back dark? inside to check it out. And it did not go no well. well. No way. You don't say. That's a dope helmet. Take that helmet. Is that a fully grown man crying? Wow. That changes things. I mean, he could have been just freak crying, but I wouldn't be crying on camera to show it to you two. So are they in India? Now to be clear, I am in no way saying that what the guys have captured is anything paranormal. It could simply be a squatter or a homeless person in the building. I just don't know. But what I do know is that team member Aldo seems genuinely terrified of what he's seen. Inside the building, he claims he saw a horrifying figure. And he... I mean... I get, I get severe reactions whenever I... Whenever I get on edge... I get severe reactions, like my eyes will start watering, and it's not my fault. My eyes will start watering. I will get goosebumps. Um, like I don't have control over it. It's just my bodily reaction. I could be completely like calm and everything, uh, but then like all of a sudden my hair stands on end, or like I my eyes start watering, as I said. Um, but yeah, this guy. This guy had to have seen something. Like, that's he even the... starts to cry out of fright. Out of Just fright? Just as Aldo is explaining what he's witnessed, the team is shaken up by a loud bang, and they all run to their scooters and just get out of there. Shortly after, they stop to check on Aldo. Poor Aldo is still in tears, and they decide to just end the video and go home. Sounds good. So what do you think Aldo saw that terrified him this much is it all real is it all just a hoax I don't know. but if it is a hoax Aldo either wasn't in on it or he's one of the best actors ever because those are real tears anyway as always you decide the curse from the time it was built in the 1960s, Weird. the Okago Onsen Inn in Tajimi City, Japan was met with terrible misfortune. Some believe that the land the inn was built on was cursed from the beginning by a dark spirit. By bamboo. Local legend claims that a woman passed away under horrible circumstances on the property in the mid-1600s and that she still haunts the property grounds. So cut to the 1970s. Okay. And there is a severe food poisoning incident at the Okago Onsen Inn that absolutely ruins the reputation of the popular hotel. Even worse, soon after this, not one but two fires destroy large parts of the building and end several lives. The Okago Onsen Inn was closed down for good. Locals say that the devastating events left the inn's owner in complete financial ruin. In hopelessness and despair, he ended his own life by jumping from the inn's roof. Today, the inn has been abandoned for 40 years, oh and the building right. is buried in <laughs> overgrown weeds and vegetation. Rumors spread that the location is cursed, and that anyone- When people get in financial ruin here in America, we don't just jump off of roofs. We move to California. <laughs> we move to California, where all the homeless people are. And then we just live off the street. <laughs> I 
I don't know why I'm laughing at that. It's not even funny. It's not even that funny. One who enters the inn will suffer a horrible fate. But why Those few who have dared to enter the inn claim that they have seen and heard the spirit of the woman who curses the hotel. Weird. They also say that they have seen the apparition of what is believed to be the inn's former owner who jumped from the roof. Do we know he so, did? So Japanese paranormal investigators like, Tomo and Hiro from the YouTube channel Omagatoki Does nobody Film know? have heard the terrifying Nuke. Do research, my guy. ghost stories and are ready to investigate the allegedly haunted inn. Together with their anonymous cameraman who goes by the name T, they Just start their investigation edge. of the creepy building. Tomo and Hiro decide to take photos of each other inside the second floor's restroom which is said to be one of the most active paranormal spots keep looking in the entire building. Sure. Things quickly take a very eerie turn. What? I don't see anything. Is that an iPhone? <laughs> I don't think that's an iPhone. Maybe that's an iPhone. Yeah, go in Stare at the camera. I think that's an iPhone. I think. Ah, ah, <laughs> I think that's an iPhone. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Weird. Huh? Nice. ならんよ。ここ。あ、これ普通だね。こっちは普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。普通の。
I'd show you if I actually had some. But I could feel my hair starting to stand on end because talking about it. That gave me an honest to God reaction. That was crazy. That was crazy. Give me more stuff like that, Nuke. Cameraman T is frightened as he claims he heard the voice of a strange woman whispering it, so. in his ear and dropped his camera in fear. Later, the you three guys are team all, members watched. You guys are all on edge. The brain really likes to do that to you. It, it, our brain is stupid. It makes us hallucinate, you know, when we're dehydrated. It makes us hallucinate. It makes us uh, see things when we don't have enough sleep. Our brain really likes to mess with us. That's what I've come to figure out. Our brain really likes to mess with us. It makes us see things when we're on edge. It makes us hear things with, that aren't really there. Our brain really likes to mess with us. So, I don't know, man. You might just be thinking about it too much. It's the footage back that he recorded. They are shocked by what they find. Okay, maybe we're going to hear it. I didn't hear anything. I tried. I tried. I really tried. I didn't hear anything. I am sorry. My dog's still okay. Woo! Is my tooth crooked? No, none of my teeth are crooked. They are a bit stained, though. I blame all the hot sauce. Did you see it? Right after the camera falls, an upside down face can be seen staring right back at the camera. Nice! Could it be that this is the face of the owner who took his own life on that very same rooftop? The owner? I thought it or was is like, it the woman's voice I who thought it was cameraman the woman's T voice. Yeah. heard right before he dropped his camera? I don't know, but it's giving me Let the me creeps. Let me know your thoughts Stop playing it. down in the comments. I don't like it. You can watch this it could also just be investigation the cameraman, over on the YouTube the channel, cameraman's face Omega Toki Film. For whatever reason. So, Meanwhile, it could on just TikTok. Be the cameraman's face. TikTok user Nina Enton shared a creepy video of her nephew, Emmy, on her TikTok page. Why? In the video, the boy discovers the hidden nanny cam that's carefully placed in his bedroom to keep a safe eye on him. But what happens next is downright chilling. What's up? terrifying face of what appears to be an elderly woman can be seen staring at the camera. No! Nina claims her nephew was alone in his room at the time of this recording. Now, fake or not, no! when I first saw this video, it freaked me out. Oh, you don't say! So, either way, the video is definitely very creepy. Oh. As for whether it's real or fake, as always, <laughs> In another video, TikTok user 17275C claims that he bought a haunted ring and that ever since he brought it home, strange things have started happening around his house. Nah, no, bro, we can't we can't just blow past what just happened there. That's what I'm talking about, Nuke. That stuff right there. Because that ain't no doll. Like, we've seen ones that, like, of ghosts, like, in front of the screen. But those are clearly, like, dolls. We can tell those are dolls. They don't blink. They look like dolls. This thing was in two frames. And it was decrepit and old and... Blah, and it was... It couldn't have been a doll. Because why would the kid have that doll? And the kid was holding it, like... This is, like, honest... I couldn't explain that. And that was weird. That was weird. I thought the kid was going to start talking to something. Which, obviously, I love those two. But this was, like... No. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. I'm like... Ah. Ah. It's... Yeah. No. It's gross. Ah. <laughs> Nick. Why? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't like it, dude. I don't like it. I don't like it. My neck. I don't like it. Uh-uh. 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 Woo, okay. All right, all right. I just checked on my dog. Okay, let's begin. I heard some 
noise down here, not the washing machine, but some like weird f***ing thumping and this f***ing thing was rocking back and forth when I came down here. Doors started shaking. Unexplained voices can be heard at night and a rocking chair suddenly started rocking. Again, in America, we don't get, we don't ever see sightings of ghosts. Like you don't ever get to see the ghost face or like, you know, you don't, you don't normally get to see the figure a whole bunch. We just get a bunch of stuff moving. Like nobody's going to believe like that could just be the, I mean, obviously it's not. And that's honestly creepy to God, but like we don't, we don't ever get to see the ghosts. We just get to see what they do and it sucks because like, oops, uh, I didn't get to see a ghost, but you know what? That ghost just broke my favorite mug. Not fun. Not fun. Back and forth all on its own. I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe different <laughs> magnetical currents over different hemispheres of the earth cause different sightings of ghosts. I don't know. I'm just coming up with this. I'm spewing just a bunch of bull out of my mouth. I don't know. TikTok user 17275C. Can someone please, like, down in the comments below? I'm sure someone's watching this right now. If you've watched this far, first of all, applaud for you. You are awesome. You're my favorite. I love you. Um, but, no, in all seriousness, can someone please explain to me why we, uh, we don't get, like, the cool ghosts? Like, I saw one video of an actual tankard, like a... a a thing that holds, like, those things, not not the ones that are the size of trains, but those things that hold gas, like, for heating the house. I've seen one of those, like, the massive ones, like, the ones that look like they're supposed to be on the trains, but they're a little bit smaller than the ones for, like, gas stations and stuff. You see them on, like, the side of gas stations. The massive ones. I've seen one of those flip a bunch of times not because of an earthquake not because of wind it wasn't even windy it was inside of a house inside of a house this thing was flipping no string no invisible string i swear no visible string that i know of can pull that giant thing it might have been empty it doesn't matter it must have still been at least 400 pounds and it was flipping from nothing why don't we get stuff like that? <laughs> now, I mean, granted, we do. We get like this, you know, creepy, you know, rocking chairs moving back and forth and, you know, blankets being pulled out from you and then like your cups, for your favorite mugs being thrown around and stuff. But can someone please explain to me why the ghosts in other regions are more powerful than ours? I just spat everywhere. Ugh! Like... Is there a reason? Like, does anybody know? Is there a theory out there? Maybe Reddit? Hey, Redditors, any theories? I know you guys, I know you guys really like to tell me some stories. Like, you, some of you guys are really knowledgeable about the stuff I watch here on YouTube. And it's kind of crazy. Sheriff's and I read them all. I read all your guys' comments. So if you have anything you'd like to talk about, go down in the comments below. I respond to every single one of them. I haven't missed one yet. So haha. -ha. Subscribe. And uh, click the bell. It's free, and you can always unsubscribe later. Anyways, back to the video. His experiences on a regular basis on his TikTok page. One night, he films as he starts to feel sick from the paranormal activity around he his house. He feels sick? So he feels sick? And, dude, you gotta shave that little spot on your mustache. I hate how it's going into your lip. I don't like that. Later, TikTok viewers are shocked when they see something in the video that he... Did not see Oh, are we actually going to see a ghost? Truly bizarre. In America? Maybe. Going to go. I and, saw. Uh, that's what we get. We get those. We get those. We don't get the faces. No, no. We get those. We get those. We get those all the time. Those aren't fun. No. Like, why don't we ever get the faces? I don't know. I saw my it, car no. for tonight. I'm not feeling good. I'm actually starting to get. Did you see it? Yeah, I clearly TikTok saw it. TikTok user 17275 c is completely unaware that the dark silhouette of someone or something. It's a very feminine figure. Me seen standing the right behind. See that? Those are some 
Oh, I got an alarm going off. Great. Hold on, guys. One second. I am terribly sorry about this. But I don't want this showing up in the video. So we're going to get rid of this alarm real quick by scrolling down and clicking stop. I seriously got to get rid of that alarm on that phone because... I don't know. I don't use that phone anymore. So, I seriously got to get rid of that alarm. But, that's how you know what time it is. It's 6 o'clock in the morning. Yes, I'm recording this at 6 o'clock in the morning. Sue me. Dim in a room. 6 o'clock in the morning is way creepier than, like, 6 o'clock at night. Because it's still dark out. Just saying. He explains in another video that he had no idea what was with him in his house. And that since this incident... He has been staying with a friend, too scared to return to his home. Why is so Nuke only in the Or is it all just an elaborate TikTok hoax? I don't know. You decide. Oh, there we go. I fixed it. Thanks for watching. Follow me. All right. Well, that's the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Again, it. this was a suggestion video. So if you guys have any suggestions of any videos you'd like me to watch, go down in my comments below, leave me a link or title to the video, and I'll get back to you as soon as I possibly can, okay? Um... Yeah, and without and without further ado, that's all I got to say. As always, guys, stay strong and have a nice day. Yep. Peace out, everyone. Do 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 do